Craft, and today we're back with the fossil of the fighters. Right. You got a spinax! Dino Metal. Because in the last episode, we uh, robbed the fossil. Spinax. So, yeah. He's cool. Awesome. One advantage of a viral process is that vivo souls can be carried around as the Dino Mythos. You can always have your favorite Viva Souls with you to challenge other fighters in fossil battles. Now, that Viva Soul right there is yours to keep, Ben. I'm awesome. <laughs> and that does it for the basics. Step, step. Was there anything I just explained that you're still not clear on? No, I'm good. Please let me leave. <laughs> okay, then. Let's take that Viva Soul to the fossil stadium for your test. If you pass the test, you'll qualify for the fighter's license. Yep. You won't be just battling by your... By the way, you'll be also tested on your cleaning ability. Ugh, cleaning! Anytime you want to practice cleaning, just talk to this staff member. Yeah, I don't like his chin. Jets out in a weird direction. I should warn you though that- I should warn you that the practice foster rocks are fakes. You can't revive them. Okay, good luck, Ben! I got all the luck. Oh, 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 got the luck, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, got the luck. You know, some people would consider you to be a very silent person. And they would be right. <laughs> Let's go to the Fossil Stadium. Wow! Fossil Stadium. I know. Where do I get my tail? Oh, another pretty lady, Tiffany. Here's my number. I call Wendy. If you get to, and then you get to. No way, they're all mine. <laughs> Keep no. your hands off, buddy. No, I want one. Give me one. No, you, you could have Dr. Diggins. No, I don't <laughs> want Dr. Diggins. <laughs> Post time, you take the cleaning test. We ready to go for the Johnny Ryan. <laughs> Think it's a fair deal? No. Yep. It's fine. You get all the girls, and I get the, and I get, like, the guy. <laughs> right, right. It's perfectly good deal. Yeah. What are you talking DDD greetings, I am Ken L34N Veep. I wish you the best, Ben. Good luck setting your fighter's license. Getting your fighter's license. Boop. 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 You must score 50 points or higher in order to pass the cleaning test. Boop. Basically, in this test, it just means pass. That's that's it, because 50 points is literally the passing line. And you can also hit the viable thing. Yes! Way, <laughs> did you lose your unity finally? No! Ben, you don't even watch yours. <laughs> you don't know that? <laughs> or have you to Hazel. Oh my god, don't even. Don't even, bro. Don't even. That was a dick move. Don't even, bro. Don't even be. Don't even be a bro, man. Don't even. Don't even be a bro. Don't even. Oh, that was a dick move. Don't even. Don't even, bro. Don't even. What? Don't even what? I'll shank you with my hanky. Are you shank someone with a handkerchief? Why does no one seem to know that? Like, everyone keeps telling me you can't shank someone with a hanky. Some people. How do you shank someone with a handkerchief? What? How do you shank someone with a handkerchief? Have you ever, have you ever seen the movie Red 2? Nope! You're stupid. Shut up! <laughs> Some people call me very intelligent. Your mother? Not just my mom. <laughs> okay. Fine, There's also yeah. Don and my dad. Oh my god. <laughs> god, we only have 16 seconds left. Crap, crap, crap. Perfection takes time. Perfection takes time, you piece of crap. I'm a master. I'm a master. Gimme. Did I just scratch it? I got just scratched it. Yeah! Six seconds to spell! Smart and success! Confetti night! Oh, seriously, I did better on this one than I did my own fossil. By one freaking point! One freaking point! Excellent, you passed, DDT! Okay, so by the way, uh, one thing that I'm probably gonna start doing is, uh, what outstanding technique! You should become a top class fossil fighter, Ben. Boop! Is now time for your next portion of your final test. V, please see Tiffany at the description desk. Boop. Is I'll pro this game has a lot of cleaning in it, and I probably will be cleaning. Basically, I just am probably gonna cut out most of the cleaning. That's what I'll probably end up doing. I'll just cut out most of the cleaning until I find one that 
either you haven't seen before. I'll probably show those. Uh, oops. And, um, other things. But mostly I'll probably just cut that part out. And I'll also be doing a lot of, like, uh, doing stuff off screen about, like, trying to get money. Because you have to kind of grind. Uh, congratulations on passing cleaning test, Ben. Well, thank you. I'm such a good cleaner. Next, we'll have to go to the common room to learn about fossil battles. Do I seriously? Oh, why can't you just skip this? This is Tippo. She'll explain to you about fossil battles. She looks very familiar. You look like Peggy, so I'm going to give you that same voice. Hello. How you doing, pal? Name's Tippo. I help people out. Follow me for a sec, will ya? Tipper? Yep. I think she'll tip me. <laughs> Over. <laughs> um, not sure. <laughs> I don't know, she's not very attractive. This is the common room. Nothing special, but a good place to get ready for a battle. I don't think I, like... I think I come here maybe once or twice during, like, the entire duration of this game after this. Alright, here's everything you need to know about battles. Pay attention, man. You have to, you have your license in no time. Um, probably gonna do this the same way that I did the cleaning. I don't know. Let's just see how this works. So let's start with the screen layout. When you see the screen layout on the battle screen, on the left the screen, on the right, your opponent's... Okay, so this is my side, this is my opponent's side. The gauge shows you life points. This is the the dinosaur's health. I believe it's souls. Uh, you have to defeat it. You have to de take away the health to... It's the most basic thing in the world. You take away the health to win, okay? First, the attack goes to determine, which is the total life points. So, whoever has low gets to go first, which is annoying when you get later, when you get strong weaver souls, and you have more than them, and then they get to go first. The battler with the lowest total LP attacks first. In this case, your LP is low... The total is lower than mine, so you attack first. Joke. Next, I'll explain about fossil power. FP. I've got to F the P, yo. This is your current fossil power. Your F that P. What? F that P. F that P. Um, FP purchases in the beginning. Okay, so basically, every time a turn starts, you get a certain amount of FP, depending on your level. That's what you use to attack and do... I think it's just attack. Or basically, well, attack in the sense that you're different attacks, but some of them are always actually offensive. Uh, okay, so these are the icons. This is information about it. That's the attack button. That's how to end your turn. Uh, so this is where we select the guy we want to attack. We only have spin X. We select the move. That's how much. That's its name. That's how much PP it has. That's how much attack. And then you select who you want to use it on. Let's use it on him. And then there's a handy dandy cutscene. Chomp. I really hoped. I really always wish that they would always do a thing would attack them, but I guess the reason they never did that is because it would actually be pretty gory. Each Viva Soul can only attack once per turn, and since we only have one guy, it automatically just says, Do you want to end your turn? Because they'll turn us pretty much over, I mean. Unless you just want to look at stuff. And those are the fossil battle basics, no problem, right? Yes, I will pwn anyone. I play this game like that, they melee time that don't need any help. Nice, Ben. Now. Oh yeah, no way, I forgot to do the accent. Now, finally, it's time for your last test, a fossil battle. When you're ready, just talk to Tiffany at the reception desk. If you don't win, then it's no license for you, so you'd better win. See you, pal. E oh, it's so funny, because she says see ya, and I always think, like, when someone says see you, they're leaving. But yet, yeah, I don't know, I'm just confused. No, never mind. Tiffany! Hey, baby. You know, this freak, this freak also wants you, but you're so Nicely done. Now it's time for your final test of fossil battle. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Yeah, yeah, if you lose, you have to <coughs> get some back to the hotel and do it again. And now that we're ready, we can enter through the right door, which opens. Open sesame. How does it open? She didn't say anything. Is it black magic? <laughs> Who are we gonna fight? Oh my god! It's Captain Travels! Travels. Aha, we meet again, Ben. Do you remember me? Uh, it's, it's not really, it's not really common. I'm the captain of the fine vessel that brought you to this island. I, I, I still don't really remember. I guess it's time for your first fossil battle, and don't expect to, and I don't expect to lose, Ben. I don't, I don't know who you are, but I'm gonna kick you, but! Oh yeah, one more thing, I should let you know. There's a formation screen before battle, but it doesn't matter now since this is a one-on-one -on -one battle. Press the ready button on the lower right of the formation screen to advance to the next screen. Alright, and then it's time for battle. Oh, you've got some moves for me. Um, if you mean dance moves, yeah. I got all kinds of them dance moves. Ons. Ons, ons. Okay, this is basically where you choose who's going to be on your team. Uh, and you can look at some statistics, but really nothing really important because we only have one guy. Like he said. Hello, battle fans, and I'm your analyst. Would you stop talking so fast? Okay, he has less LP, so he's going first. So he's going to use rocket on me. Ugh, he's going to headbutt me. Ugh, I'll eat your face. 
Activating auto counter. So the way that works is uh, earlier I read that he had a ability to knock back damage when he's attacked. Basically, what if it, when you most of the time when you get attacked, it's gonna be like double digits. Basically, whatever the the number to the left of it, if it's a case of a hundred something, it's the two numbers to the left I think is dealt back. The that one number is dealt back to him. So if it's like 77, 66, and it just goes back. So that's kind of cool. I mean, in this case, he only did like well 14 or 12 damage, uh, 12. So it only did one damage back. But you know, so let's use Spinax Fang on him. Chomp, smack. Ah, I did like twice as much damage as him. More than twice as much. And yo, in my turn. He's dead next turn. I'm such a pro. Although you suck. Yeah, I'm yeah. pro. Ooh, 11 damage. Is that all you got? I'll chomp your face off. Mm. I don't know why I'm giving like a sexy deep voice to uh, Spin X, but whatever. Spin X, food. Chomper! Chomper, chomper, chomper. I'm gonna chomp you. Uh, uh, uh. 30 damage. You're dead. You're dead. You're, you're, you're super dead. By the way, that color on the green ball means it's attribute, so that dinosaur is also high. <laughs> I meant to say arrow, and I said hi. I don't know why. Oh, yeah, I didn't really point that out, but those two guys, like, talk during the battle. It's really kind of pointless, but I don't know. Well, how about that, Ben? I guess that makes you an official fossil fighter. I already knew that. Now, I've got some advice for you. If you lose a fossil battle, you most likely... We already learned that. But try to save as often as possible. You, no sense taking risks at your age. Uh, I've already been doing heroin. All right, here's a little something for you. It's a fossil rock of the Viva Soul that you said you liked. Okay, this is the other thing that changed. I guess I should have explained this so that way you knew, but... Well... Depending on what kind of dinosaur you chose in the very beginning, you get a bone correlating to that dinosaur. So he's saying we like the uh, Velociraptor, so now we got legs for, uh, for the Velociraptor. Uh, but that fossil rock I just gave you what? isn't a head fossil, so you can't revive it right away. What? That just seems weird, like... I got Velociraptor legs, ooh. <laughs> isn't that your favorite part of the body? No! <laughs> That's my favorite part of the body. <laughs> remember Josh has a foot fetish. I remember Serranus and I had a foot fetish, and then, um, like, I was- I'm pretty I sure- said, No, I don't, and he, like, freaked out. I'm pretty sure most of the time we just said Josh has a foot fetish, and then he'd be like, No, I don't. We're like, yes, you do. Your head is somewhere out there for you to find, Ben. Oh, the head is somewhere. Yes, because you can't, if you can, like, uh, bless you, a different body part besides the head, it, it doesn't revive it. And when you do revive it, that part is added on as well. I'm wishing you the best, Ben. Good luck. So wait, if you only found a head and you revived it, it would just be like a floating velociraptor head? No, it's just, like, that's the only part of it you have. So, like, it's not very strong. Well, not as strong as it would be if you found other parts, at least. Congratulations, Ben. You passed your fighter's test. I can now present you with the fighter's license. The only thing I don't like is I like the color, but I don't like Velociraptor. Like, he's one of the guys that you can choose that actually, like, you can get pretty soon, but I don't really like him very well. Like, you can get him in the first area, but I don't really like him. And there we go. We got a fighter's license. I'm a level uno fight day. You got the fighter's license. Yeah. That's proof I do hair win because I'm 18. No, this is the yeah, that is proof that you and I are recognized fossil fighter. Congratulations, Ben. That makes you a level one fighter. You now have access to some features on the status screen, which again, oh my god, I just remembered I forgot to learn if I can get in the status screen. Crap, yikes, where did the time go by? You must be tired anyway, Ben. Sorry for the yapping again. Yep, 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 yep. That's all I hear from your mouth. Yep, yep, yep. Your life as a licensed fossil fighter begins with a bang tomorrow. Does that mean I'm gonna get laid? Get yourself a good night's rest. Hey, Ben. What? It all started with the big bang. Wait, you're a virgin. <laughs> Best of so luck on you, you, Ben. So <laughs> are you. There's no proof. Best of luck on the road to becoming a master fighter, Ben. I'm gonna become a master fighter because I'm so cool. I'm gonna become a master fighter because I'm so sucks balls. Actually, I need, uh, I need to, uh, yes, I'm... Chapter 1, The Missing Meadows. Hey, guys, we're back. Sorry, I just had to cut something out because Anzul was being a very, very bad person. I'm never, ever going to record him again. Oh. Yeah, that's what you get. That part gets cut out. <laughs> Dang it. But I'm still going to leave in the part where I said you suck balls. Ah, you bitch. <laughs> hey, that's bad language. You can now open the status menu. Oh, wait, I can't, because I don't know what button that is. Hello, right. anyone help, yeah. Ben? I forgot a few, a few things. I do that sometimes. 
but you do Doctor Doom. Ben, why don't you just look in the options menu? For the game? Yeah! I- I don't know how to do that! This is you fighters, Junior. Junior. Press escape! Try that. I gotta, no, I don't wanna screw anything up. I got a diary! I got a diary! Dear diary, I'm gonna shank someone with a hanky! The fighters, Junior is really useful. I'll tell you what you're supposed to do next. Also, here's a sonar system for finding fossil rocks and a pickaxe for digging them up. These are very important thingies. Picky, picky, and a Sony, Sony. The sonar device detects objects buried underground, including fossil rocks. You should really get some practice first, Ben, so I recommend you try to go to the Try or Dig site. Which is in the park <laughs> area. So go talk to B. Gino at the park area. I should show you the ropes. Uh huh. That's a very ironic name, isn't it? What? B. Gino. Wow. <laughs> Anyways, I've got to get back to the fossil center. Stop by if you have any questions. So when are you gonna tap that? What do you mean? You and uh, Dr. Diggins. I don't... No, Ben. Just no. <laughs> uh, oh, sweet, I do. I knew this happened. Little thingies popped up and I can click those to go to the menu. Sweet. Ah! Oh, my uh, God. Hotel manager. Greetings, Ben. There's so much ta I'm so sorry, guys. This first two episodes are oh, just completely for freaking text. Congratulations on acquiring your fighter's license so quickly. Please allow me to explain briefly about the status menu. The status menu, if you I don't care, actually. That one down there. You can click the X button, or if you're on the computer, in this case, you just click that. Blah, 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 no, I do not want to hear your explanation again. Thank you for all the time. I'll let you be on your way now. You know, I think A actually might be enter. Uh, I guess I can show this off real quick. Okay, so if you click the orange one, I think it's the status menu. You see your level, your FB recharge, which is the one you get every turn. This is how much you can carry one time. Your money, your team. This is the fossils in your inventory. That's the Velociraptor's leg we got. Uh, the Fido's Juno. That's what tells us what to do next. The fighter's license, proof of a level one fighter, or of course I would change when we get other levels. Our sonar and our pick, and it says normal sonar because it can be upgraded later, but we'll talk about that when it actually shows up. And over here, I guess we can look at this real quick as well. Uh, shows all of the dinosaurs and our team, and this is just the auto. What the frick are you doing? Sorry, I'm eating. <laughs> Okay, oh uh, yeah, we got it. Okay, so there's three main areas. This is the fighter area. We're about to go into, I think, yeah, the park area. And then there's another one that I forget what it's called that we won't go to any necessarily time soon. So we're going to talk to Beginner over here. Going to try to do this up before we finish off. So you knew the f new fighter area, huh? My name is Beginner. No jokes, please. <laughs> I teach all the rookies who come here the basics of digging up fossils. So we go into the tribe dig site and get some hands-on experience. Oh, that's the kind of thing I like. Oh my god. <laughs> you want that with Dr. Diggers, don't you? Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god, I couldn't help it. Okay, so up there we've got our sonar. And I have no idea what that thing to the right is, honestly. I've never paid attention to that. I'll, maybe I'll look it up. That's our sonar. As you can see, it can be that big. But for now, it's only that big because we'll lose those. Alright, let me show you how to use your sonar. We'll pull. <laughs> this is us. Oh, he's hurting me. He's hurting me. Sound like you're either getting murdered or you're having sex and you don't and you're like, oh, it's hurting! I'm getting murdered. Okay. Press the L button or right button to activate the sonar and display dots where something is buried. So you can use the arrow in relation to where the dots are because that's a rock. And then you push A button to dig on top of it. And she's gonna bury three rocks which we have to dig up, which is so stupid because we can see her putting them there. Crap, I wanna hurry up and dig these up though before we, before we have to end it off. Just skip through the text. Uh, I did, but she's so stupid. Now I have to use a stone now. Uh... Oh, Ben, just, um, uh, cut. I'm gonna do something. All right, guys, I'm gonna cut out something real quick. I don't know how to use the flippin' stone all, so I'm gonna try to figure out how I do that real quick. Okay. Hey guys, we're back. <laughs> I found out how to do stuff. Uh, it's E. Yeah. 
Yep, that's how you do it on the computer. That's how you so on. You got a spin axe head. Yeah, if you've already dug it up, um, you it tells you what it is. That's exactly how you do it. Mm, looks like this fossil you've already revived, baby. But you can clean the same fossil again for more points. With a better quality fossil, we can in integrate more genetic data into your Vivasol to make it stronger. Yeah, so you can try to get a better score if you want. Uh, blah blah blah. You can hold X to get it to where it says. You can hold your old A. You can store more later, but for now, wait. Wrong button. What was it again? E. Right. Yeah. Where was it? There it is. It's down there. Click, please. Click. There we go. And it's just a normal rock. Yay! Yes, unfortunately, you can dig up normal rocks from time to time. Yeah, it's just nothing. It's not. It's really nothing. Uh, now we'll diggy diggy over here. Y you got a new fast rock. Yeah, that's a fast rock you have yet to find. You won't know what's in the fast rock until you cl you've cleaned it, baby. When we're done here, you want to take it over to the fast center for cleaning. Okay, now feel free to roam around to dig up fossil rocks in this area. Take the fossil rocks you dig up to the fossil center for cleaning. Dig, clean, revive. That's the path to a large, stable, powerful, beautiful, and successful battle. When you're done, or you're ready to leave this trial dig site. Just let me know. Okay, that sadly though, that's gonna be it for this episode. Um, I hope you guys have enjoyed. And yeah, I just realized I forgot to leave to do the outro last time. The one I'm supposed to do, because because I'm supposed to say that if you enjoyed it, you're supposed to leave a like and subscribe and comment, cause comment has feedback and commenting is good. Commenting is unless you have a negative comment that don't even comment it, you piece of crap. Um, yeah, that's it. We'll see you guys next.